So this person requested Pythagorean theorem. So we start with the square, and then we have another square that's the exact same size. So these two squares are equal to each other. Then I'll make a cut that is the same size as A, and I'll do the same thing to the other square. Do the same thing to every side of that square, and the same thing to every side of this square. And then this other piece will be B. Then if I make a cut right here on both squares and pull this triangle out, this is the same triangle that's in our notes up above. So this side right here is C, this side is also C. And let's bring these down here. Next, let's make another cut here where this is A and this is B. And let's make a cut here where this is C. And then if we pull both of these triangles out and bring them down there, these two sides should still be equal to each other because we pulled the two same triangles out of both of them. Now let's make some more cuts here, here, and here, and also here and here. We, we've now made more of these ABC triangles and we can pull them out and bring them down here. And so out of both sides, we've pulled four of these ABC triangles. So they should both still be equal. So this square right here is an A by A square. So the area of it is A squared. This square has sides B, so its area is B squared. And this square has sides C, so its area is C squared. We can call this left-hand side A squared plus B squared because we're adding these two squares together. And that's going to be equal to this right-hand side, which is C squared. How exciting.